My name is Diane Homer, and I started working with NRC in 2001. I enjoy interviewing all sorts of people. There's a huge interchange of ideas and facts that's in an atmosphere like that. So if I'm dealing with a young person, there's a fresh idea there. If I'm dealing with an older person, there's a more experienced idea. And when you walk away from an atmosphere like that, you can't help but take something away that's going to be useful to you later on in life. Sometimes there is apprehension when it comes to knocking on a stranger's door, but that is quickly overcome. Um, I realize that we have something that the respondent needs in order to make his life better, and that gives me the courage to go on and to present the information to them. I think an important skill that an interview would need in this line of work is to listen very carefully to the respondent. Uh, dignify the respondent by showing them respect and then protecting the histories of their lives that they may choose to share with us during the course of the interview. Some of the questions that we ask are personal questions, but we are required to sign a statement of confidentiality and this information is presented or made known to the respondent beforehand. And once the person feels comfortable with that, then they pretty much are at ease in uh, providing personal histories about themselves. Some of the projects in ORC is known for uh, improving neighborhoods, um, following the life course of an individual from childhood to uh, families and careers. I've heard about gambling uh, projects, medical research. So there are a number of projects that this uh, organization is responsible for. What we do is important because it's going to affect the lives of individuals. It will have a great impact on a person's life. And I like doing that. I like having a share in that. So it's very important.